I love burritos! Oh my gosh, guys, he's doing it! He's doing it! I'm crushing it, bro! I'm crushing it! What's going on? Hashtag Burritos Nation. Chipotle Rainbow Warrior here. I knew that that briefcase would come in handy for belt videos. We are cashing in on another belt unboxing review episode video thing about Bob on your boy Rainbow Warriors channel. Yeah, I love burritos. Uh, anyways, guys, this is a belt I've been waiting for the WWE shop to put out on their site for the longest time. What was it? April? Yeah, April? One of the NXT takeovers, was it Brooklyn 3 maybe? I, I can't remember, I'm probably completely wrong. Let me know in the comments if you guys know, remind me. Um, when this belt debuted, the NXT North American Championship belt, baby. And I just realized I've been so excited about making this video, I didn't even get my knife to like open my box, so we'll have to find something to open it up, but we're going to wing it anyways. But my favorite... NXT superstar, Adam Cole, baby, won it in the first ever uh, NXT North American Championship match at an NXT TakeOver and uh, in a ladder match with six men with Lars Sullivan, uh, EC3, we had Ricochet, we had um, uh, Velveteen Dream, and as well as uh, Alistair, no, not Alistair, something Wolf, Alexander Wolf. Yeah, I think that I think I actually remember Hell Six just off the top of my mind, which is cool. Uh, so, anyways, guys, we should just want to get into this because I'm really, really excited to get this. The current champion is, of course, the one and only Ricochet, aka King Ricochet. And I just feel like being cool, I'm wearing my Benny and the Ink Machine hat. A lot of you guys have no idea what this is, but it's my favorite video game. It's an indie horror game. Anyways, guys, we should go and get to this. We got this belt unboxing video to do, because that's cool beans, and it looks like it's not like that wrapped up that well anyway, so it should be easy, that's going to be easy to open, so hopefully there's no scratches or anything wrong with it. But we're going to go and get this out, it's going to be my first ever NXT championship that is a uh, current version. I do have, of course, um, my NXT title right over here, we might as well just hit it yeah, down anyways. NXT 2014 championship that was first won by Seth freaking Rollins, baby. And I just love this spell, and I do think eventually someday you guys should let me know in the comments below also if you guys think I should get the current NXT Championship um, that was debuted just last year in 2017. I do really, really want to get it. I think I'm just going to wait for a big sale, even though it is one of the belts on the shop that is like really, really uh, not as expensive as the other ones, like 429, like the world title. Anyways, I'm stalling. I'm talking a lot. NXT Championship right here. I might get the current one at some point, maybe the next belt we'll get. But we're going to go and unbox this NXT North American Championship belt, which I'm really excited to get because it's my favorite belt in the WWE right now, even above my United Kingdom Championship belt, which was before this belt came out. So we're going to go and open this up. We're going to go pull this belt out of here. Oh, man. It's going to be my first one with a full um, new... Uh, Thing involved with the, the logo right here, the NXT logo. All right, so headphone users, watch out. Sorry, I just have to do it every time. I just love bubble wrap. <laughs> We're gonna go put that off to the side with my, some of my other belts. I need to start putting some more belts on the wall. I'm still waiting for my Ring of Honor towel to eventually get here too, but yes. We're gonna go and get this bad boy out. The NXT North American Championship. Oh yes, get out of here, bro. Here we go. The new leather smell it smells so good. I'm so excited. This feels so great. Oh, man, it's a light belt. It's a light belt. Sure, is that a two or four millimeter? I think it's four millimeter. And but yes, here we go. The NXT North American Championship belt. Super excited. To open this bad boy up. I really like the color of it. Of course, it's black on the back, so I won't see that right off the bat. But all right, so here we go. Are you ready? This is actually, I'm just going to stall some more because I can. <laughs> Something that's really making me happy because it actually uh, got in here four days early. It was, it's the 2nd of November, same day as Crown Jewel pay-per-view, which I just watched live because I did have Friday today off. Um, and I was pretty upset about the Dolph Ziggler, like, huh, I'm going to call it the Saudi Arabia screw job with Shane McMahon. But anyways, I won't spoil too much, even though I probably just did. But this made me happy. To get this right after the pay-per-view, pretty much. Perfect timing. We're going to go and put this off to the side. Haven't looked yet, so I'm just seeing the back. There's a lot of screws. 
Oh, baby, that is looking super cool. <laughs> oh, man. All right, let's go and get this wrapping off of here. And go ahead and get a detailed look of this NXT North American Championship, my favorite belt in the WWE. It's not a really heavy belt, by the way, but it is a, just a beautiful belt. I've seen pictures of it, and I've really, really been excited to get my own ver my own uh, replica. All right, so let's get that off of there. I love how it has a gold tip. I love how the, the belts have gold tips. Let's get this blue sticker off of it that protects the gold tip. Oh man, oh man, get that off too, as well as that, oh I really love this maroon color, it's not a normal red, it's way different than the uh, universal title, we can actually go ahead and compare that if we want, um, but yes, the North American Championship in 3, 2, 1, oh baby, look at that, wow, <laughs> that is a beautiful, beautiful belt. My first ever NXT style championship, the NXT North American Championship, which I'm really, really excited to have. One first by Adam Cole, baby! And now, the one and only King Ricochet has it. Oh my gosh. Look at that championship. My favorite championship in WWE, and it's just absolutely gorgeous. Really light too. Um, it's light, like it's not as light as the United States, but it's pretty light though. Uh, actually, a lot lighter than I thought it was going to be. But a beautiful belt nonetheless. That is upside down rainbow. Let's go ahead and put the hat down. Focus on wrestling, not bendy. NXT side plates. These are interchangeable side plates. Uh, the store ones, just like the NXT uh, Heavyweight Championship, NXT Championship. Um, who knows if we'll ever actually get to have any um, side plates. I assume we'll eventually get to, since they are on the actual t TV on NXT and NXT TakeOvers. We see these special superstars with their special uh, side plates. But yeah, man. Pretty simple anyways. We got ourselves a big, gigantic strap. I really like it. I like the details. Pretty floppy for a replica. They did start making them a lot more floppy when it came to the United Kingdom as well as the Cruiserweight tile. And then the same with this one. Very floppy replica. A lot of people didn't like the shape of the strap. I really like the big strap. I'm a big fan of it. As well as with the uh, tag team belts too, which I have over there. I'm not going to show you right now, but... <laughs> Yes, we got ourselves the NXT with the little WWE logo in the middle right there. Pretty cool design on the side plates. And like I said, once again, hopefully someday we'll be able to get some Adam Cole bah, bah, side plates for this belt. We got ourselves NXT in the top North American Championship with the North American continent right there, which is pretty cool. Beans, America, that's where I'm from. We got Mako, we got Canada, Canada. And yeah, that's pretty cool beans. And yeah, let's go ahead and get the universal title actually, and we'll go ahead and compare the colors some. Because it is a red, but it's like, it's a maroon. It's like a version of red, if you can even call maroon that. That's at least I think. But yeah, you can definitely see a gigantic difference here. Uh, the red, the dark red here, and you got the maroon, just like a brownish red here, which is just really, really cool. I like it. I like it a lot. So there we go, guys, the NXT North American Championship belt. Let's go ahead and put the Universal back down over here somewhere. Be careful, Rainbow, lots of belts over here. All right, don't fall down, please. And there we go. NXT, NXT, NXT. Very, very good way to make my day a little bit better after being really salty about what happened to Dolph Ziggler earlier today. But yes, the NXT North American Championship. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this episode, because I know I sure as heck did. <laughs> Oh man, I didn't even realize they have the little. That is so cool. Do they have that on the regular NXT belt? They don't have that on any of these ones. I just noticed that. That's a really, really cool detail right here where they got the um, the extra um, silver little screw looking things right there. They're not screws, but they're, they look like them. They're little silver little um, places right here. What is that? Uh, one, two, three. Hexagon. <laughs> three little hexagon silver ones on the gold tip, which is cool. I've never seen that on a belt before. Um, and that's just pretty cool beans. I like it a lot. Anyways, guys, love you guys so much. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did enjoy seeing my new NAC North American Championship belt as much as I did, then let me know in the comments below with a like, 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 comment, comment, and subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. And I love burritos. And I love you all so much. And I'll see all of you hashtag burritos nation later. The NXT North American Championship.
We don't want no ham and cheese. We just want burritos, please.